Welcome to cram.com. This is the uh, website that we're going to use for our vocabulary practice and review. And what I'd like for you to do is once you get to this screen, we'll go up here to sign in. And to create an account, um, and sorry about the ads, you can close those down here. To create an account, we can uh, click right down here on sign in with Google, and we'll just use our school email. So you can choose or it'll let you type it in. And that is going to bring us to a uh, screen with um, our flashcard creation screen uh, that will allow us to do a few things with that. If it doesn't bring you to this screen immediately, just go to your profile and click on the flashcard dashboard. And that is actually what this screen is. So we're going to go ahead and uh, move on to creating a new set. And to do that, we'll click right here, create new set. And we're going to focus on uh, the terms for lesson 1.1. Uh, you'll notice in the Google Doc for 1.1, uh, right down here in the vocabulary practice, you'll find a list of uh, the terms that we're going to use. So we're going to call this set title after our lesson doc, which is 1.1. And we'll just make it easy. For subject, you can put PLTW. And we're going to leave it on public because you will share this list with me uh, as you create each set. All right, now we're going to scroll down, and this is where we're going to see where our flashcards actually are. To begin with, um, we will put the term uh, on the front and the definition on the back. So we'll go ahead and start with term number one, which is physical computing. We'll click in that flashcard. And then on the back, we will put the definition as you read it right here. Now, I suggest that you type it out just so you get used to the term. That helps expose you to that definition. Uh, and I would do that for each one of your uh, terms. So you'll go down to the next card and you'll put in the second term the definition. Now, initially, they will give you three. But once you get down to this third one, You'll notice you can add a new card here or just press tab and it'll give you access to that. So at this point, you can go ahead and create your flashcards for the terms in the current lesson that we are working on.